Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a logo in Canva and work on the templates because there's already a, a preset templates in Canva that you can use and just shuffle it and tweak it to come up with a unique design that you want. And then we will also cover like the ways for you to download your logos into transparent and make it like have a different types of like style in your logo so if you are interested in that stay tuned because i'm gonna show you how without further ado one two three so to create a logo in canva it's highly advisable that you use the perfect square so if you click this create design in here and you select the logo you have a lot of options that you can tweak so if i type in like if it's my if my business is about marketing all of the logo related to marketing will be shown in here like if it is an e-commerce or let's just type in influencer in here like everything is there that you can just change and tweak so for example i want to come up with this maybe i'm gonna crop this part here and then we'll add something in the c with this one oh sorry so i'm gonna remove that add that put it over there so what i really like about canva it's super easy for you to edit it so i'm gonna copy that and move it over here and put that there if you see here like even though we use a preset logo in canva it's still our i mean we can still come up with original design and what i really like so by the way first let's just jump in let's just download this one as a png format because we really need most of the time we need to have a transparent background of our logo so um in order for you to download that simply click this download and make sure you you check this transparent background in order for you to download the um the no background version i'm gonna change this one with the color like this color so download and then and then we will also cover later how you can animate it so okay so if we um view this one so it's already like it's perfect it's like there might be something that we can tweak like um making the circle a little bit like thinner we can do that but yeah just the purpose of this presentation this is how easy you can really come up with your original logo design in canva there's a lot of things in here that you can just tweak even designers even graphic designers just look for inspiration and then they just revamp it and tweak it to make it look better and you know kind of align to what they are doing so what if you already have a logo and you just want to have a circle version of your logo so as an example let's say we grab this one again i'm going to put this here and you wanted this part here to be cir circled so the first thing you need to do is you download the, the like this artwork first you click that one download it download okay let me just copy everything there and then once you've already downloaded that artwork with the background choice you want um we can then choose an elements frame like a circle elements frame and you can even use different frames if you want but normally if it is a logo the circle one is the common thing that people are using okay so we will use the circle frame and then i'm going to click this upload over here click the upload media put that there and then we put it over there and i'll just make this one block for you to see like how it looks on if it is already um downloaded as an mp uh, as a transparent or a png format so if you download that we click this png we click this transparent background we click the download um just copy that on here 
if you're going in here, you view this one. This is just how easy you can come up with a circle version of your logo. So the other thing that I really like about in Canva um, when in terms of creating logo is you can animate it super easily, like super no brainer. You just, just need to click this logo and then you click this animate. And if you have you click this animate there and you have a bunch of elements like a bunch of animation thing that you can um, use super really I, I would say that that is super awesome for me so um, let's say I'm gonna use the the breathing because it's more like it, it has a simpler vibe um, what we can do actually in here so it it doesn't look busy like that we can um, Duplicate this one. Okay, duplicate first. So we can duplicate that. I'm gonna remove this um this um animation in here. And then this font. I'm gonna remove this font here. And then I'll make the animation maybe just two seconds or yeah, or one seconds perhaps. Let's just try one second and then let's try to play it. See that um, we probably kind of like there is a breathing thing in here. So I'm going to try to put something here with a breathing as well. Okay, let's just try this one. No, so I'm going to remove this breathing. I don't want it to be super redundant. Um, what I'm going to do actually is duplicate this, remove this part here. Um, we'll have this animated. I'm going to make this one animated, maybe this. And this should be just um, maybe just super 1.1 seconds. Yeah, or 0 0.2. Let's play it. So, yeah. So, you just need to polish this polish it a little bit but basically here in canva you don't need to hire like if this is just a simple animation you really don't need to hire a video animator to do the motion thing for you and yeah so if you're really good with the animation thing obviously it needs some adjustment i'm do i'm just doing this for as an example so if you're really good with the animation thing you download that you click the mp4 or you can also select the gif format if you don't if you use if you want to use an image version mp4 and you click the download click this one and the signed title do that see how super easy it is to do it I hope you find it valuable and if you have any questions or concerns, don't forget to send me a message or leave a comment down below. Thank you!